I was upstairs with my daughter and my husband heard her crying. So he came upstairs and she was crying for him. And he said, I was on the floor and I was out. They had to call the ambulance and everything. And then they took me to the local ER here. They did an MRI and that's where they found the, the tumor. I was of course shocked and afraid. And at the time I was 27. You know, who thinks of a 27 year old having a massive brain tumor? Massive. They said the size of like a baseball. She originally had a seizure and then had a scan that showed a tumor. The tumor was taken out and the kind of tumor it was told us she needed more therapy than just the surgery. Sometimes brain tumors, all you need to do the surgery. Sometimes brain tumors, you need to do more treatments like radiation or chemotherapy. And hers was a kind that she'd benefit from both additional treatment with radiation and with chemotherapy. They said I was gonna to have to do therapy and the best option for me was gonna be the proton therapy. The advantage of the type of radiation that she got, the proton radiation therapy, is that it allows us to target the tumor area much more precisely than other kinds of radiation. And this is one where she probably wouldn't benefit from extra radiation to parts we're not aiming at. So she had a treatment with the proton therapy that was much more focused, much more targeted to her tumor area. Where she is now, I wouldn't expect it to be that much different whether she had gotten the regular radiation or, or proton radiation. The differences I'd be hopeful for would be five and 10 and 15 and 30, 40, 50 years down the line. I would be hopeful and optimistic that Ashley's brain will work better, that she'll have a better quality of life, that her risk of other tumors forming from the radiation, that her risk of other things from the radiation like strokes and other blood vessel changes, all that should be much lower as the result of the proton. I don't know how, but presto poof, she somehow knew my name. It worked out great. She's gone through things wonderfully. Uh, very few side effects thus far. Hopefully, um, she'll continue to do well, both from the tumor standpoint and the, the side effect standpoint from the radiation. But so far, things are going very well. For now, I'm living life, and I'm living life with a great attitude. I have to go up monthly or bi-monthly. Because of having this brain tumor, I have to have MRIs on a regular basis. I have to see my oncologist at least once a month. So I truly love University Hospital. They've truly helped me tremendously.